welcome to our Estic how do you, how do you say a Tuscadero Airbnb. This is our Moro Casita is what it's called. Come on in. So we're staying here for two nights. This is the living room. Leather couch. Beautiful table. Okay. Um, and then here's TV. And then here's a really thoughtful, this is a pet friendly Airbnb, so there's a really thoughtful like leash area right here, which is super cute. And they even left some s'more stuff for us, and I'll show the outside area in a little bit. Yep. And then here's our kitchen. It's pretty spacious and very, very clean. And there looks like there's some glass, wine glasses there. So that's the kitchen. And then here is the bedroom. Looks just like the pictures. It's really cute. Here's the bed. And then, yeah, it's pretty spacious. I mean, it's not really that spacious, but the, the bed looks really nice. And then here's the bathroom. Yep, and we're here for two nights and I'll show the outdoors now. All right, and here is our outdoor area. First of all, we have this gorgeous, um, <laughs> here we have this gorgeous barbecue grill that we're probably not gonna use. There's Papa Bear. And um, here's our gorgeous like outdoor area. There's this beautiful um, flowers here. You step down and there's this cute little bench. Sorry, it's a little windy. And then here's a little um, fire pit area that's just it looks like it's fueled by propane over there, so we don't need firewood, which is really good. It looks like these are lavender plants. Oh my gosh, so beautiful. It is so peaceful out here. Um, here's a little overview of the area. And then here's even more of the backyard um, that I'll just kind of walk over. So this is all ours, all of this space right here. And there's a little swing right there. And yep, this is what our Airbnb looks like. I did want to mention really quickly that we brought some Clorox wipes. And yesterday and today, um, I used several of these to just wipe down like fridge handles and doorknobs and switches just to make sure that they're all super clean. And then there's also this big bottle of hand sanitizer here as well. We are getting takeout now and Mr. Pika is coming with us because every time he's in a new environment he doesn't like being left alone and he's just going to stay in the car anyways. Ready? Cheers. Ooh. Hey, this is white. This is for you. No, I would drink the red one too. Whoa. This is more sour because, oh wow, this you can. Good. Really? I don't know if you're going to like this one. Here we have a 
2016 Syrah. And then this is a blend of Cab Syrah and it's Cab Sav. Cab. I can't talk right now. Cabernet Sauvignon, Syrah, and Cab Franc. Mmm, really good. Oh, and Pika has been eating rocks. Even the lady was like, is your dog eating rocks? Um, yeah, his idiot ass is eating rocks, actually. It's time to make his birthday dinner now. Every year, we make a birthday dinner for him. <laughs> Look at how tired he is. Stinker. Okay, happy birthday to you. Hey, let's sing. Birthday, birthday to you. Happy birthday, birthday to your papa. Happy birthday to you. Ding. get some seafood. I might actually get some seafood even though I eat primarily vegetarian, but I'm gonna get some seafood. It's very foggy here. And there's the rock, the famous Moro rock right there. Yay! Here we have some clam chowder in a bowl. We have some delicious barbecue oysters. Andrew got a salmon burger. And then some raw oysters over there. Oh my God, looks so good. <laughs> 